Hey everyone, what's up? It's Dartron here, and we are finally caught up with Minecraft Story Mode as of this video. I believe this is the last one. Uh, let's try and have fun with it. Uh, let's just jump straight on in. Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. If these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer. That's not what I was expecting. See, this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs, guideposts. You can call me Harper. Your bravery is an impressive quality. I look forward to studying the aspects of your personality. Once you have been made useful. We'll see about that. What is that? This is the redstone heart. Beautiful. It can help you find your way home. How is this going to do that? The answers you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. Adventure? Okay then, let's see where this is gonna go. Hopefully nothing too complicated to start off with. Wow, that... that's a lot of stairs. And all revealed by the redstone heart. Amazing. Yeah, not bad, right? I'm just gonna take this thing? Okay. After you. Okay, guys, I'm not sure what's up there, but whatever it is, we all need to stick together. You got it? Yeah, we've got your back, Jesse. It's a smart plan. Huh. Really Feels like just yesterday we were building this place. Still don't agree with some of the aesthetic choices. Wait, you're from here? Uh-huh. What's the big deal? It's a big deal because we've been in the old builder's world this whole time and you didn't tell us. There was never a natural time to bring it up. Kinda thought I'd never need to come back to tell you the truth. Whoa. Okay, that's impressive. Gotta say. Oh, I'm sensing a story here. I guess you could say that. What are you hiding from us now, Harper? Nothing. Nothing. Well, almost nothing. Just the others might not be 100% happy to see me. Others? You mean we're going to meet more old builders? Still don't like it when you call us that. Yep, but I gotta warn you. They're not as friendly as I am. I'm probably the, uh, nicest old builder. Uh-huh. Old builder social politics. My goodness. Are you joking? You think you're nice? Yeah, I don't know if you remember the whole Pama thing, but, uh... Hey, I had good intentions with that, all right? Don't make me regret helping you. Well, you're gonna give us the Atlas, and then we can go home, right? Kind of. The Atlas isn't exactly mine to give. It belongs to the other, uh, old builders. And, well... They might not want to give it up. Mm-hmm. I knew this Why was Why do I get the feeling there's a lot you're not telling us? Good instincts? Harper, I thought that's why we brought you. To convince them to hand over the Atlas. You're not gonna let us down, right? I'm gonna do my best, but I warn you now that there could be... complications. What kind of... complications? You'll see when you get there. Jesse, come here. Are you sure we can trust Harper? Look at all of our interactions with her so far. They haven't exactly been great, remember? No, I think she's definitely hiding something. But if we're going to get home, we need her help. Agreed. Don't worry, okay? We're gonna get that Atlas and get home. I'm sorry to hear you feel that way, Jesse. Sorry. I just couldn't resist a good eavesdrop. I promise you both, I am trying to help. You just gotta go through there. A, a door? Like a regular door? Time to step through and find out. I don't trust her at all. Ah! 
very what? bright. I see a thing. Before you go in there, I have one more piece of advice. Don't die. What? <laughs> Yeah, kind of, kind of saw that coming. I'm not gonna lie. Never trust someone that builds evil computers. Come on, Nell. I'm oh. trying, Al. Dig, dig, faster. Go, go. I oh no. We can't stop. Well, what do we have here? Seems as if some new competitors have entered the match. My, isn't that special? Some sort of crazy game. Really? You think this? Game. Jesse's right. Spleef. Is it tight? No, it's a game. You try to knock the floor out from other people and make them fall. Be like that. Whoa. Here we go. I was never very good at spleef. That was my only decent teammates. Oh no. Really use Axel about now. Oops, did face me drop something? Time to dodge. Jesse! Jesse! I'll help Petra. Get Ivor quick. <laughs> <laughs> Nice one, Jesse. That was close. Ah, <gasps> uh, no. Oh, no. Lucas! No, 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 no! What? It can't be. Whoa, no way, dude. I got a double. <laughs> no! It's <laughs> so, okay, they'll just respawn. Hey, hey, whoa! This is a misunderstanding, dude. What are you doing? Hey! Using weapons is against the rules! Rules? Not cool, dude. So not cool. Slab is down. I repeat, Slab is down. Stop the match! Not since the days of Tim have we seen such heated play. That's totally against the rules, right? Yeah. I didn't think we could throw TNT back at the gladiators. Nice one, brah. Who do you think you are? Whoa. Now, I and think... now you're just trying to be all buddy buddy? You killed one of my best friends. Hey, I don't care about your compliments, and I'm definitely not your bra. Whoa. Hang on, dude. I am not in charge here, okay? It's them. Yes, we are the ones in charge here. And we have never had to stop a match. Ever. It definitely is strange, Mavia. What is going on here? I want an explanation. Immediately. Uh, this is not going to end well. It built pretty quick. This is going to require some reconfiguring of the stats, for sure. My friends are dead. You killed them. Wait, wait, wait. A and that's why you're ruining our games? Yeah, come on, jeez. How petty are you? Ugh, lashing out just because your friends were eliminated. Kind of sore loser behavior, don't you think, sport? It is part of the games. Oh, I've got a game we could play. I'll go first. Okay, just tell me straight. What are these games that you keep talking about? I think if we all just calm down, I can explain. Your friends aren't dead. Wait, what? How? When people are eliminated in the games, they don't die. <laughs> that would be wasteful. <laughs> Obviously, they come back and then we have them go work in the mines. Jesse! <gasps> Your friends are alive and well. Let my friends go. Sorry, sport, but they were eliminated. <laughs> Them's the rules. It's called respawning, champ. We're not monsters. <laughs> in our games, when people die, they reappear in one of our respawn zones. I hear it's still pretty painful, though. Well, Sport, now that you've come and interrupted our games, I'm sure our fans would love to know how you got here. Spill! Go, oh, why bother? They all end up in the mines. Eh, uh, here We're we go. From another world. Eh? Yeah? Well, you and everyone else here, Pipsqueak. You know what you are? Champ. 
You're just a little gate crasher. And what do we do with gate crashers? Kill them and send them to the mock. Back off, muscles. Jesse's with me. Well, if it isn't Harper. I must say, this return is unexpected. You're telling me I'm here for Jesse. Oh, really? So tell me, champ, why do you think Harper brought you here? My bet's on Pet. That'd be pretty cute, right? Oh, adorable. We came for the Atlas. I want you to hand it over so my friends and I can go home. Straight into the point. Well, I'd like it. If I weren't simmering with barely controlled rage right now. Hmm. We're, of course, not going to do any of those things, but admirable try. Well, that's all well and good, but I'm confused. Why would we give anything to someone like you? You weren't invited. And you interrupted Spleef. Because I have something you want. Oh? <laughs> you must be joking, Hadrian. Joking. Oh, jokes! Ha <laughs> ha! Hilarious! Nope, not joking. I doubt you'd have anything that would interest us. Wanna bet? Oh, send them to the mines. They're cheaters. Let's make their lives miserable. For fun. This is not against the... What about this? <gasps> I present... The Redstone Heart! Huh. Seems like only yesterday someone took off with that and vowed never to return with it. Oh, but I didn't bring it back. Jesse did. Thing's no toy, slugger. How about you just hand it over, huh? It can be, uh, pretty dangerous if... You don't know how to use it. Nuh-uh, Hadrian. You're not getting one finger on this thing until you hand over my friends. I'm not a big fan of haggling, Jesse. Here's the way my offer works. You give me the heart. You and your friends go back down to those portals. I never look at your insignificant face again. Wait, without the Atlas? But how will we get home? So, not my problem. This is a one-time offer. Clearly, things have been getting out of hand. Let's start over and see if we can reach an agreement. Okay. Okay, fine. I can always appreciate someone trying to be reasonable. Well, you need the Atlas. And I need competitors. After your unexpected intrusion, I seem to be short a team. So how about this? You play in the games. If you win, the Atlas is yours to keep. It's a good deal, Jesse. Trust me. Everyone enjoys these games. I still don't trust you. Don't you worry, Jesse. Once a rule is written into the bylaws, we make sure it's enforced. Isn't that right, Hadrian? Oh, yeah. Otto is a real stickler for the rules. Good. Hmm. All right, then. I suppose we can carry forward with the official oh, Otto, enough. Add it on your own time. Oh, but there's one other thing I want. If they lose, Harper has to go to the mines, too. Oh, gravel. Harper, want to be a friend and show our new competitors to where they'll be staying? Sure thing. Oh, this is not going to end well. I can feel it already in the pit of my stomach. Jesse, this was not part of the plan. Wrapped up in one of Hadrian's deals. Ugh! He's not one to let other people get the upper hand, you know. Wait, but this was your plan. You said you had it all worked out. Yeah, about that. I didn't think you'd willingly come here. I might have acted in haste before uh, I could work out all the details. You don't say? Uh, I'm, s I'm sorry, okay? I really am. Let me show you where the competitor village is. Oh, I, I get a funny feeling she's going to stab us in the back. Right in the back. With a very big implement. And it's gonna hurt. We used to have competitors from all over. Travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other. Just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. 
Well, here it is, the competitor village, sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. Wait, are all of these people competitors? Yep. At least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Seems like you don't approve. I don't. Believe me, these people would rather be here in the village than working in the mines. Mm-hmm. Slave labor. They didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And what if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games. But it might take a while. I'm gonna go confer with Otto. We go way back and, well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Wait, we still haven't found Lucas or Ivor. Ugh, I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Well, then we're just gonna have to get them out. See what you can do here. I'm gonna try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. Mm-hmm, maybe because he's the hero. We gotta get our friends out of the mines quick. I'll go ask some of the other competitors. Okay. Let's have a look here. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat! Wait a minute. You're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slab! And face meat doesn't look cheaters. Don't stand around breathing up all of face meat's air. Face meat prefers dweeb free air. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines! Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on Facemeet's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there. Staring at Facemeet. Please, what can I do to get them out? Well, now that you mention it, Facemeet was busy slamming mad raps at the gym and missed lunchtime. You see? So Facemeet's hungry. Do something about that, and Facemeet'll think about getting your friends out. Oh, great. So I gotta make this guy a sandwich? You're joking me. Some sort of practice space. Looks like everyone's working hard. Oh, smells like it too. Block foo. Whoa, it's you from Spleef. You were like amazing. I am now, and I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your probs upset, especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> Speaking of my friends, have you seen them lately? Nope, sorry. They're like probably in the mines. And that's on me. Such bad karma. Bad karma. Ugh. I will never do that to one of your friends again because man, I do not want to be on your bad side. I gotta say, you keep playing like that and you'll be like Tim status. Tim who? Tim! Like the legend of Tim Tim on the signs. Like one, okay? Like you could. People could like already be talking. They're gonna like say stuff. Compare you to Tim. It might be a little uncomfortable. Or not. It's cool. I'm not here to be a Tim. I just want to get home. But that's like exactly what makes you Tim status. Tim didn't want to be Tim either. He got his whole team home! Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you, so if you ever need anything, you just come and ask, shall? No, I mean seriously, I mean anything at all. Like, I want to help out people. Well, actually, do you have any extra food? Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. 
Come on, uh, quick before anybody sees us. Okay. It's just we. Mm, why? Why the secrecy here? Tim's a lame name for a hero. No offense to anyone called Tim. Just kind of saying. Go ahead. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, brah. It'll grow back. Just, uh, leave the seeds, yeah? One. Planting as I go. And that's another. <laughs> okay, even <laughs> I do this quicker on normal Minecraft. Sweet! And that should all grow back soon. Nice! Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. So... And I guess I'll just have to make my own. Where can I get some wood planks? Hey, I remember a bunch of, like, wood planks by the dojo. I think they train by, like, punching them or whatever, you know? Thank you, Nell. Hey, no problem. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah? Yeah. Like, dude. What's up? Wow, hey, you are that crazy person in extreme spleef. Decent. Not as good as Tim, but decent. That's more than I can say for most. But not even a third of what Tim was. So, you ever meet Tim? Me? Meet Tim? Oh, I wish. Here's the secret. We're all just trying to be like Tim. He's perfect. Okay, I'll leave you to it then. Oh, well, these people treat Tim like the way other people treat YouTubers. Impressive. Hmm, something's fishy about this Tim guy though, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Your stupid teammate killed Lucas. Yeah, I couldn't believe Nell pulled that off either. Don't forget they respawned, duh. Don't cry about it. We were doing what we had to do to win. Until you screwed up everything. Next round! If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will! <sighs> you haven't been here long? So you wouldn't know. Unless I win, which I will, you've got guts. I respect that. Just can't wait to see those guts on the arena floor. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. Looks like Tim won. Yeah, Tim. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. I'll do it. Don't you worry about that. There. That should be enough for a table. Aha! That's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. Yeah, let's make that food. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. You say that, but I want to still have a look around, see if... Nope! Can't go that way. That's fine by me. Okay, let's just see if we can find anything else around here. Something interesting. Oh, Petra. Hey, Jesse. Finding your way around all right? Yeah, starting to. Nice. You know, this place would actually be a blast if it weren't for the whole against their will thing. I mean, Spleef was awesome, but a little bit of the fun gets taken away when you're forced to do something. Totally agree. The actual game was fun. It just stinks that all this has to be part of it. 
I just hope we can get home soon. I'm a little creeped out by the people that run this place. Let's keep trying to find Ivor and Lucas. Agreed. Agreed. Here lies the platform on which Tim stood to win these great games. Hope I'll be standing there soon. Wow, they look focused. They must really want to win this thing. Mm, yep, they most likely do. Well, there is a lot of stuff here. Oh, shovel planet. Nice. Nice. There's a shovel. Get over it. Okay, well, who have we got here? Hey! Get out of here before I see if I can attach this sign to your head. <clears throat> it's so nice when new contestants are in the village. Yeesh, why is everyone so cranky around here? Could be that we're forced into an endless cycle of destruction. Just a guess, though. Fine, I'm out of here. Bye-bye! Can't wait to kill you again! You actually haven't killed me yet, so that statement is inaccurate. Excuse me? Psh, wow, rude. There always has to be a snob, doesn't there? Hey, that's Lucas's journal. You say something, Tiny? Because I'm trying to read here. Hey, where'd you get that book you're reading? Oh, this? Fished it out some respawn's inventory after he... It's got some tales of adventure, feelings, and other dumb stuff. Hey, wait a minute! You're the pipsqueak that knocked me out of my tower. Yeah, and this belonged to that little blonde buddy of yours. Let me guess. You want this back? Because I'm actually enjoying myself. There are some fascinating and thrilling tales in here. Yeah, hand it over, meathead. And slab the immovable! Get out of here before I use this book to punch your face in. Fine. I just want to get through one more chapter. <laughs> Can't you see I'm trying to read? Jeez. Huh? Sorry. Well, I was hoping to see we can make a deal. That armor is pretty sweet. Not as sweet as mine, of course. <sighs> okay, so now let's give him his bread. Now that I've walked to everything else. <laughs> Um, hello? Hey, face me. Got some bread for ya. Bread, huh? Hm. It's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mmm, it's so warm. Oh, and full of carbs. Please, get my friends. <laughs> face meat appreciates the politeness. Hang on. Hey, Petra. Hey, glad to see you already figured out the whole nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, nice. It seems like we keep ending up in situations. First with Palma, now with that stupid sploof game. Well, what I'm trying to say is, thanks. You know, don't make this awkward. It was just on my mind, and... Hey, of course I saved you, okay? You're one of my best friends. Well, I just hope Ivor isn't too jealous. I'm glad you're with me in this, Petra. Me too. Here! Oh! oh response. Jesse. Man, is it good to see you. You too, Lucas. And Ivor. <laughs> Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Shut up. My outfit breathes wonderfully. Anyway, how's it been going out here? You, uh, you don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary. I'm working on that. It's tricky, though. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. As long as we stick together, it's gonna be fine. Either get the atlas and go home, or we'll be stuck in the nether together forever. That is not reassuring, Jesse. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> yeah. How does that guy know? It's pretty bad in there, Jesse. 
They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just... <sighs> stare at you while you mine. It's been terrible! And we weren't in there that long. Lucas, we need the Atlas to get home. <sighs> I know. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. So you're the one who's supposed to help us? Well, I'll enforce the rules at any rate. If that helps you, then uh, can't be games without rules. <laughs> Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Mm. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting. You being here. I can feel change in the air. Great, as long as I get to go home. That is the point. But you have to win first. And my job is to make sure everybody, even Hadrian, plays by the rules. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Yeah, I don't think Tim's Can real. Can trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Ah, oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. You try to get that. Wonder what there. the next event will be. Hopefully, nothing too deadly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. Wonderfully! Yeah, I bet something like TNT one. This is like a multiplayer server. Uh, mini games. Yeah. Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the games. <laughs> it's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Spleet, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh, I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course, about our plucky newcomers. Otto, shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. I wonder how this is gonna go. I can't believe how much they love this Tim guy. What's up with that? No idea. Definitely weird, though. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? A race. We've totally got this. <laughs> got this, huh? Boom! Surprise locker room visit. Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian. And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. Winning. Ooh, in the zone, huh? That's excellent. That's just excellent. Hope you managed to hang on to that optimism when the heat's on out there. I admire your confidence, Jesse, but I must ask, what makes you think you can win when so many others have failed? Huh? That's a good question. Do you really think you're special? The thing about me and my team, Hadrian, no matter the challenge, we always find a way. Oh, really? Because it seems like two members of your team have already been eliminated. Yeah, and there's two left. More than enough to win this. Yes. Perhaps we should just get on with this. <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, 
Good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but... Uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? Oh, Em, glad to see my charms finally wore you down. Well, I was thinking about how you handled Spleef, and then you made that deal with the old builders, and... I thought... An enemy of my enemy is my friend. Whoa, that means M wants to be, like, friends with you, Jesse. <laughs> what? M might be up to something. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? I could use an ally. And you could use my help. <sighs> come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. Oh, come on, Em. You expect me to believe that? What are you up to here? Nothing, honest. It's just... Watching you negotiate with Hadrian, trying to get home. It inspired me. Made me want to go home, too. We should be working together. In the middle of the race is a part with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean, that's okay, too. You got a deal. Good. I won't let you down. Competitors! I don't trust to you. To the starting line! Meet you at Gladiator Junction. Gladiator Junction? That sounds awesome. That does. At least we won't have to fight her and the gladiators. I'm ready for this. Those gladiators are going down. Hint, it's going to involve a lot of punching and kicking and all around awesomeness. Remember, there's no I in teamwork, Petra. Yeah, but there is a me in I'm going to kick their butts. No, there isn't. There we go. Game faces. See? I just like wanted to say it's like an honor to be working together. And I'm glad that M like totally suggested that. We can do this. Uh yeah. I knew that you were cool from the moment we met. Competitors on your mark. Here we go. Get set. Go! Okay. Oh. Whoa, watch out. Here we go. Whoa, whoa. Come on, we can do this, guys. It's not that hard. Oh, it's going to get that hard. No! Here we go again. E. E. Ooh, made it. Uh, we did it. This has been pretty tough. Can't wait to see what else they throw at us. What did we get ourselves into? And you're just getting started. Huh? Whoa! Out of the way, chumps! Q. There we go. E. Got him. Yeah, you guys think you can really do this? We, we're the heroes here. You can't beat the heroes. Ah, like rule one. No! One down. Moving, just keep moving, just keep moving, just keep moving, just keep moving. Not quite. Whoa. Got him. Two. Okay, now where are we going? Gladiator Junction, I presume. Okay, sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? Oh, my body! Probably the one throwing him around. Well, that answers that 
question. For oh, one yeah, night? Slab, you seem pretty outnumbered. Just means more fun for me. We'll see about that, right, Em? Em? <laughs> oh, big surprise. Fine, squishy. <laughs> what? Jesse, got your back. Go! Go! Ah, uh, no. Nah. Looks like you're all alone yeah, now. Yeah, that's mad. Uh, tired of you, Slab? I was just thinking the same thing about you. Come on, I can do this. Enough. Oh. Well, there goes that sword. Not eliminated yet. Go! Yeah! Kill it! Okay, maybe I can still win this thing. Shouldn't have trusted. Yeah. Dude, I am like so close. I could do this. Sorry, now I'm winning this thing. Okay, come on. Catching hey! Up. Whoa, whoa, Jesse! Way to catch up, dude. Very nice. You just can't take a hit, can you? Get huh? dunked on! Whoa! Slacker! On. Whoa! No! Ah. Why well, gotta be the good guy? Oh, come on! No, 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 no! Dude, that was so Tim! How are we gonna get out of here? Oh, the water, little dude. We can ride that wave right back up to the top. Follow me. Yeah, but we're never gonna catch up now, are we? Enough for you. Thanks for saving me. Yeah, I don't mention it. Should have let you fall. I'm the good guy. 